It's Tire Safety Week and Fox 44 is teaming up with Discount Tire to get you the information you need. And tonight we're focusing on why tire pressure is important for your car and for your wallet. That one especially. <laughs> Fox 44's Kendall Green joining us live in Waco tonight after being on the road all day. That's right, Robin and Leslie. I went to Zephyr to test out a theory that it that proved to be true. Low tire pressure does affect gas mileage. But before I left, I did stop by Discount Tire in Belmead. Meet David Sanderson. Been checking your air pressure. He's the tire guy at Discount Tire in Belmead. He typically sees an influx of customers around this time of year. Summertime approaching. Uh, Memorial Day is, is uh, a big holiday that uh, we see a, a pretty large increase in uh, you know, tire awareness. I told him about my plan to drive to Zephyr on tires with the right pressure. And then before driving back, I would lower the air pressure 10 PSI in each tire. It definitely relates to uh, saving money in a long term, in a long term sense. You know, maintaining proper air pressure in your tires, checking it once a month, um, it will definitely save you money in the long run. For this adventure, I chose the station's 2017 Toyota RAV4. It has about 28,000 miles on it, a four-cylinder engine, and it normally gets about 23 miles to the gallon in the city and 30 on the highway. I set my trip odometer to zero and was off. Roughly an hour and a half later, I arrived, took a quick pick stop, and figured out my mileage so far. Now, I just put about four gallons of gas inside of the car. Now, you divide the 113 miles that I've traveled by those gallons of gas, and you get about 28 miles per gallon. Now, all that's left for me to do is take some of the pressure out of these tires. And just like that, it's back on the road for me. Now, I filled up when I got back to the station, and I saw that uh, actually my tires, well, my miles per gallon, it dropped by three. And when you actually add that up, uh, that's almost like, having a full tank of gas or half a full tank of gas. Uh, but for now, reporting in Waco, I'm Kendall Green with Fox 44 News.